I think nowadays, uh, university education is not just about teaching inside classrooms. And I think um, we should care about student learning outside classroom and also their development beyond universities. And I think care is the foundation of education. And I think that the CARES model provides a conceptual framework uh, for my work in general. Uh, let me describe the CARE model um, briefly. Uh, the CARES model has three layers, right? The core layer, uh, the course layer, and the development layer, or the career layer. And the core layer address the fundamental, right? Um, the fundamental thinking capabilities of our students. You know that our brain has two sides. The left brain, which governs uh, logical thinking and computational thinking in general, and also a right brain, which governs creative thinking. So the fundamental layer, that is the core layer, seeks to uh, foster whole brain development. The career and development layer uh, help students to work in a particular area. So after graduation, students will develop their career in one of this area. So application is about applying computing in a certain area. And research is about uh, continue their studies and engage in research work. Entrepreneurship is about starting a new business and some students will also uh, go out to serve uh, in a particular organization such as a charitable organization. So um, in the CARES model, we aim to provide learning activities for students to develop in these four areas as well. And I think it's important for every student to realize their strength and um, weakness and to identify the best area for their development. Okay? Remember the four areas, application, research, entrepreneurship and service. And some students are better in, the, uh, in a certain area. Also about the core layer, how can we enhance students' computational thinking capabilities as well as creative thinking capabilities? So in other words, on one hand, we, we need to train students to think logically in a computational way. And on the other hand, we also uh, train them to think out of the box in a non-computational way. And how computational thinking and creative thinking can work together and to provide students with a more powerful thinking capabilities um, to solve problems. Actually, I think this is inspired by uh, 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 my experience and also uh, by talking to many different people. Uh, and I think uh, many educators or many teachers also have the same feeling that uh, nowadays university education should not be about uh, teaching inside classroom, but uh, but learning, uh, support, uh, uh, enhance student learning outside classroom as well as to support their development in different areas in order to provide uh, all-round computing education. The depth and effectiveness of Dr. Chan's teaching can be seen easily in the performance of students. In recent years, they've received over 30 external awards from various computing competitions. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Dr. Henry Chan. The field of computing is changing very rapidly. Think about this. 10 years ago, we did not have smartphones. And over 20 years ago, we, we did not even have the web. So thinking forward or looking forward, we, we do not know what will happen 10 years or 20 years later. So we may be teaching students for an unknown world or career. Actually, I sometimes tell my students, what you are learning now may become obsolete tomorrow. I plan to do more work 
uh, or research on this uh, KS model. Uh, although the KS model provides uh, the conceptual framework, I think more work uh, should be done. I would like to give my most sincere thanks to the IEEE Computer Society uh, for giving me this uh, award. Uh, I would also like to thank uh, the Hong Kong Polytechnic University for giving me this uh, supportive environment for developing my uh, teaching career. Uh, we should uh, think using both sides of our brain. That is the left brain for uh, logical thinking and right brain for creative thinking. And uh, this allows us to see problems from different angles.